Investigators say it was here at this Round Rock house that 28-year-old Crystal Walraven left her five children, the oldest 12, the youngest just 15 months old. When officers arrived, they noticed an overwhelming odor that smelled like a mixture of feces and garbage, an unattended infant lying in a crib, and multiple knives the children had open access to. Walraven telling officers she drove to Houston and flew to South Carolina, only returning nearly a week later. When we arrived at the house, Walraven answered the door to explain her side of the story, saying she asked her neighbor and child's father to help. He was supposed to be over here with the kids, and he even told him that he was here the night before, when he got him food and everything. Mary was here during the day. She was actually had to give them the car seats because she had been taking the kids back and forth to school. Definitely didn't abandon them. They were supposed to be here with the children and did not do that. Police say the two adults checked on the kids, bringing them food periodically, but never stayed the night. One neighbor telling us she noticed strange things in the past. The kids were outside until midnight, 1 o'clock in the morning sometimes, and then we'd get up and they're, they're out again at 6 o'clock in the morning, and they're on the trampoline and they're carrying each other around. and you know. It was the principal at Gaddis School Elementary who tipped off officers after one of the children mentioned having to stay up all night changing diapers. While Raven is now facing two felony charges for abandoning a child and placing them in imminent danger. Yeah, okay.